Hello YouTube, this is your boy Mr. Crazy Guy 23 Today talking to you about my Blackberry Curve that I just got from Virgin Mobile. It costs $250. I have a $50 plan, which I highly recommend since um Virgin Mobile don't have nights and weekends and 300 minutes could go by quick without the nights and weekends. But it is it all comes down to you. I mean, only you will know, you know, but anyway, um I don't have too much to say about this. It's just like every other BlackBerry phone. I do the same thing, do the same stuff. Um, you have your messages, you have all your fancy stuff, your maps, everything, you know. It's basically like another BlackBerry. Um, it is fast, though. The browser is fast, I would say. Um, the volume is loud. Like, Let me watch this. Um, I just got here. I don't know what this video is about. About, um, but I don't feel like such a video, so yeah. It's the opening night of the 35th annual Toronto International Film Festival. I'm Mary Kitchen here for Red Carpet Diary at the Visa Screening Room. Okay, so enough of that. Um, yeah, so that was big. Um, so the brows are pretty quick. Um, let me show you some like speed tests. Let's see, go home. Let me go to some place I never went to on this phone before. Um, let me type in Virgin Mobile. Hmm, that was pretty quick. Well, most of these are applications, though. No, oh, that was an epic fail. Search the internet. Um, I never visited. This is going to be my first time visiting here. Axe.com. Does take a um when you visit a new site, it does take a while, more like ten seconds, at the most. But it's still pretty fast. Um, let's type in ver. Virgin Mobile. That didn't take more than like five seconds. Let's go to this site for the very first time. Oh, it's done. So, yeah, that was a bad. 10 to 12 seconds. So, yeah. So, I just keep pretty fast. Pretty neat. Um, does have multitasking. Which is all... Uh, um, just like yeah, every other standard BlackBerry phone. So, basically, this is like... Every other BlackBerry phone. Like, the at and Like, this BlackBerry curve is just like the other ones. Like, the one at and t and... The one Verizon will try to sell you. Same thing. The only difference about this one, it doesn't have a contract. So basically, if you don't pay your bill, you um, you know, you just didn't pay it. So oh well. You don't have to worry about you know, it going up. You never overrun. You can't go past your minutes. So when so you you won't be charged like that fee where you pass your minutes. So. That's what's pretty neat about it. That's what's pretty neat about it. So, um, if you have any questions about about this, please either comment me or PM me because because I really can't do a review on this. And the reason why I mean it because it's just like every other BlackBerry curve. I mean, if you want to see a review about it, you could go online on YouTube. I bet there's there's tons of videos about it. But I I'm just here. If you want to if you want questions answered, I'll give them to you. So, um, one application I will recommend for the BlackBerry though is um Tether, T E T H E R, great app. Um, it basically provides you internet service for your laptop 
everywhere as, as everywhere you go as long as you have a signal. Um, it's fifty dollars, which is kind of hefty for you know one one application, but if in the but it's kind but it's worth it though. And the reason why I say that because imagine when you go to all these hotels and other places, like coffee shops, or you're on the road. You normally know, have to pay like ten dollars for thirty minutes of internet, or like twenty dollars or something, which is kind of dumb. I mean, you know, ten dollars for thirty minutes of internet that sucks. But with but by paying fifty dollars, you get unlimited internet access, and your BlackBerry is now a modem for your laptop. How cool is that? But don't worry, sometimes they do have specials. Like they cut the price in half. Like one time it was their birthday, so they cut it to the, it was twenty dollars. Another time it was twenty five dollars. So I won't lie, I'm waiting until the price goes to that sale, and that's when I'll purchase it because I'm not going to blow fifty dollars on just you know one application when it could get me like fifty applications for one dollar. So yeah, so but other than that, regular BlackBerry do everything. Do everything another BlackBerry would. So I'm also comment if you have any questions, tell me. There's no such thing as stupid questions. It could be from should I get this or the LG Rumor Touch? Um, what plan will um, be best for me? And what makes and you know why should you purchase this phone? I'll be happy to answer your questions. You either could comment me or you could PM me. So that's basically my quick review on my BlackBerry, I guess. So, yeah. So thank you for watching. Um, you don't have to subscribe. You don't have to rate. All I ask for is just a comment and leave me a question. That's all I ask for. So, yeah. So later, YouTube. Peace out.